Hello traders, uh, hello traders. Uh, the title of this video is RSI Trader explains a simple but powerful RSI trading method. RSI Trader explains a simple but powerful RSI trading strategy. All right. Let's get started, all right? So what are we looking for? We are looking for a price structure, price action, a specific price structure, all right? So we want we know that according to the market stable data, all right, the minimum price move is free. So whether a financial issue is going up or down, minimum price move is free, all right? So whenever we see a financial instrument that goes down one, two, three, you see here on my chart one, two, three, is that clear to you? All right, one, two, three. Minimum price move is free, but the RSI is rising. If the financial instrument start changing direction after three move here one, two, three, and start changing direction here, at the same time when the RSI is rising. We have a bullish trading setup. So I need to clarify to new traders who are not yet subscribers to this channel that uh, when we use the word trading setup, we do not mean trading signal. There is a, a huge difference between a trading setup and a trading signal. All right. So the trading drill that we have been talking to our subscribers for years that they know already, I'm speaking to new traders that are watching this video, we are looking for a trading setup. Then we implement a top-down trading method looking for the trading signal. And then we select a low-risk entry point to enter the trade like a pro without ignoring the economy news and the trading triangle, the market first, the sector before the individual financial instrument. So that's clear, all right? Big difference between a trading setup and a trading signal. So this is a bullish trading setup. We will now implement a top-down trading method or we will now adhere to the trading dream the setup, the signal, and a low risk entry point to trade it. Boom, 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 boom. You see here? Boom, 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 up. Minimum price move is free. One, two, three. RSR is rising. Price change in direction here. This is a bullish trading setup. Will you promise me? All right. That is to make you laugh a bit. All right. Will you promise me in the comment section, <laughs> okay, that you will try your best, okay? To improve your RSI trading with this uh, trading strategy. All right, you don't have to promise me anything, okay? All right, here again we can see here price goes down one, two, three. Clear, yes or no? RSI is rising at the time. This is very important. At the time when the price formed the three moon, here we are among the weekly chart. So you can see that we have a very long candlestick bar here. So for a lot of traders, it will be quite challenging. When I see a long candlestick bar like this, I stay away from it. I will prefer another pullback, you see. This is not a good one. So, But if you were on a daily chart, so if you see it, it popping up like this, you will see it on a daily chart because you're on a weekly chart. Before this, you see this weekly candle is formed of uh, five daily candlestick bar. Yes or no? So probably you will see it on a daily chart that is that changing direction here. And also traders who are following us at two four stock trader channel understand candlestick bar we have a hammer here a hammer another thing i need to say to traders when you see one two three down ask yourself is the price at a common support level or at a hidden support level what is a common support level common support level a support level that we can see on the chart hidden support level are a Fibonacci, okay, extension level, all right? So with those uh, knowledge, so with uh, that information, so you want to make sure that after the one price for me, one, two, three, where is ending, because you want to buy, you want to make sure that you are buying at the key levels. That key level can be a common support level or common key level or a hidden key level. So, talking about Fibonacci extension, traders that have been following us at Depot Traders, know that we use the 138.2% level, 
very important key level price from a low if it did below that low the next challenge for that bearish momentum you see you have to subscribe to our channel now if you are new be busy look for day pro trader youtube channel subscribe there and don't unsubscribe you don't lose anything all right and look for two four stock trader youtube channel subscribe there and don't unsubscribe okay even if you get upset with me one day you unsubscribe the next day wash your face and uh, <laughs> all right and resubscribe again all right okay so we know all this price so we want it to one more thing so you may say joe what are you talking about now okay so you see here it went down all the way here minimum price move is free well, i want to make sure that where it's ending look at that look where it, the, the three moves ending what can you see one three eight point two one i use one three eight you see here can you see one three eight on my chart here it is that's why it's top so now i'm i noticed that the price from one two three ending at a key level now look at my rsi rsi 14 is rising this is a bullish trading setup so now i go into the next mode should be clicking all right trading drill i find a trading setup doesn't mean buy straight away like the old way we now implement a top down trading method i'm on the weekly chart what is the signal time frame for the weekly chart four hour time frame or two hour time frame what is the entry time frame for the weekly chart 15 minute time frame i implement a top down trading method if the signal is fired, I do not enter on the signal time frame. I go to the entry time frame. I want to enter at a low risk entry point where the market environment is suitable. Talking about market environment being suitable, it's quite challenging for day and swing trader to trade between the first and the eighth of each month and also from the 15th to the 20th. Market environment is suitable. I implement a turn down to the middle to trade it. Here again, you can see here one, two, three. Right. Is it corresponding to a common support level or a hidden support level? Well, look on the chart if you are looking for common support level or common key level. There's one support level. You see the tail of this candle. Can you see the tail? If I remove those lines, you can see I move my line a bit. Okay, let's remove that line by the way. What? Right. The tail of this. Uh, are you if you see the tail of this candle that's here that's a support level boom 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 you see in that zone so there is a support in that zone you can see another support here it bounced up so one two three to a common support level my rsi period 14 is rising i have a bullish trading setup but remember if you see that you see a tall candle you may stay away from it all right you may, so you will prefer it to pull back but then if you see to at early stage you may have to go to the all right daily chart all right to take it from there all right very simple we are combining a minimum price move which is minimum price move is what is free to the data following us at 24 elliot wave youtube channel know that did you subscribe to 24 elliot wave youtube channel subscribe and do not unsubscribe all right <laughs> okay stay there it's free all right so here we are so minimum price move is free one two three price at the key very important you want to buy buy the support you want to sell set a resistance level talking about support and resistance level a resistance level can be normal horizontal resistance level resistance can be a trend line resistance can be a fibonacci extension level resistance le level can be also a price target level talking about convergent points goes down one two three rsi is rising we have a bullish at the point where it's changing the rsi must going up another thing that we can do to improve this uh, rsi trading strategy so stay with me that's what i say to you very important to watch the full length of our video <laughs> all right if you don't have time don't start watching it okay or you can consume it bit by bit as YouTube allow you to do that. You will see the red line on your YouTube where you stop, and then you take it from there, okay? <laughs> now, this is to make you cheer you up a little bit. All right, my friend, don't think that I'm kidding. I'm not kidding. Okay, now, another thing that we can do to improve this RSI trading method is this. So you see the RSI is rising at this, all right, you see here? Another thing that we can do to improve this is that we will prefer, remember, 
I'm choosing my word carefully. We will prefer that the LSI reaches the Vaso zone, which is the 30 level, before start going up. We will prefer that. We will prefer that. So I'm adding more condition to it. So I started with it in a simple way, a powerful way. But I want to add more information to help traders that want to get it perfectly right. Okay. So we will prefer normally that the LSI was oversold first, below 30, before it start rising. At the time when the price is completing the minimum price move, at this point in time. So you can see here, in each case, here, you can see that in each case, the LSI period 14 did below the 30 level before start rising at the time when the price is completing the minimum price move free at a key level. One more time here, you can see that the LSI did below the level of 30 before it start rising. So that will help you to filter out false, okay, LSI trading setup as we are discussing it here. You see here, we will prefer it to be oversold and then start rising when this is happening. Another thing that we can recommend to more advanced traders that are using different time frames, we talk, we talk about, remember, we were talking about the validation of the trading setup. But I don't want to confuse you today. Uh, all right? We don't want you to make it too complicated. We want it to keep it simple but powerful. But I can talk about it now because you get the, the, the key point now. Another thing that we can do is that, as you see it's happening like this, it was oversold, it's rising, it's completed, you can be a little bit curious. So because I'm on a weekly chart, I'll go to the next higher time frame, which one? The monthly chart. And I want to see also what the RSI on the monthly chart is doing. So anytime we are looking at the RSI, one thing that a lot of traders do not do, they don't pay attention to the slope of the RSI. Is the RSI sloping up? Is it rising? So I'm drawing on my chart a line on my monthly chart because I'm trying to see what is also happening to the RSI on the higher time frame because the higher time frame commands the lower time frame, okay? <laughs> All right? So at the point when this one was happening, you see here, this is the first one we were looking at, the RSI on the monthly chart was also rising giving me more confidence that my trading setup on the weekly chart has a more chance to succeed. But I am a trader. I'm still in charge of the trade. So I need to speak to new traders, all right? Because sometimes traders uh, will go and purchase our trading system. They think that the trading system will trade for them. No, the trading system do not trade for traders. If you are looking for something like that, go and buy a trading robot, a black box, and you'll be surprised that it won't help you. What we are doing, we do sell some trading system, and now we go into the classroom, which is the YouTube channels, where we are talking about how to trade. So one can know how to trade, and then one will be able to use those trading system more accurately. It takes time, it takes more experience, all right? It's gently, gently, all right? So... This is one thing. So you see here on the monthly chart, it was rising. Look, at the point when the second one was happening, I still got my line that I've drawn on the weekly chart here. You can see that my RSI came near, you see, it, you see, it dropped down near the, the level of 30, and then it started rising. You can see it start rising. Are you, are, do you agree? If you disagree, tell me in the comments. So it, it came down very fast to the level of 30, and then it's Start rising on the monthly chart at the time when this one was completing on the uh, weekly chart. So we can uh, use different okay time frame as we see the setup on the weekly chart. We can go to the next higher time frame to trade it. This strategy is valid on all time frame. So we can use it. We can look for this trading setup on the monthly chart, on the weekly chart, on the daily chart. So, but on the daily chart, I highly recommend to trade when you're on the daily chart and you see this trading setup because the daily chart can exhibit a lot of distortion. When you see on the daily chart, which a lot of traders love, all right, do me a favor, try to go to the weekly chart all right, to see whether it's adding up and do not violate the market patterns. I do not want this video to be too long. I'll tell you clearly, okay, the RSI, okay, a simple RSI but powerful RSI trading strategy that you can, okay, learn, master, and 
apply to improve your RSI trading. To summarize this video, we are using the market stable data that stated that the minimum price move is free. The price goes down 1, 2, 3, right, but the RSI is rising. It's a bullish trading setup. We must use a top down trading method. In order to validate our trading setup, we can go to the next higher time frame also. If on a higher time frame the RSI is also rising, that will give us more confidence that our trading setup has more chance to succeed. Another thing that we will prefer, I'm choosing my word carefully here, prefer, is that we will prefer that the RSI is, was oversold first before it start rising. Will you promise me that you will do your best to start improving okay, your RSI trading? All right? We wish you the very best in your trading and until the next time, enjoy yourself and uh, be very happy. We are the TSTW24 traders talking about RSI trader. Explain a simple but powerful RSI trading strategy. Is it simple? Is it powerful? Let me know in the comment section. Happy trading to you all and I'll speak to you uh, soon.